नमस्ते अगेन दिस इज विवेक तिवारी फ्रॉम कैबल धाम लोनाला टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट बैड हैबिट्स ऑफ आवर डाइट यू नो गॉड हैज गिवन टू ऑर्गन्स विच आर एनिमी ऑफ ईच अदर विच आर दोज यूर टंग एंड यूर स्टमक ओके यूर टंग लाइक्स अ स्पाइसी फूड oily food fast food junk food you know and then sweets etc because it is having the taste buds but whatever that spicy oily junk food fast food you are consuming because of your tongue stomach don't like that because it is for it is heavy for digestion then your pancreas has to work more secret more insulin for digestion of the sweets your liver and your duct they have to work they have to secret more acids and more secretions so it's a over work for them and then you suffer from different problems so whatever your stomach likes because your stomach likes a satvik food easy for digestion light food but your tongue don't like that so you don't pay attention on the stomach you pay attention on the tongue on your taste buds so that is why when you consume that tasty food and when you consume it regularly again and again because it becomes your habit and that habit is not only at the tongue at the physical level but it becomes here at the psychological level because you, mentally you are not ready to accept that satvik food are nahi 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 it's not tasty but when it goes in the stomach and when it is very heavy for digestion that time then you start burning sensation hyper acidity indigestion sometimes loose motions constipation gases problems then you have a mouth ulcer mouth ulcer is you can feel it you can treat it but after that when you consume that food regularly again and again after that what happens the ulcer peptic ulcer inner wall of your intestine is having injuries and then you feel burning sensation then it goes on regularly after that after a long time then you suffer from like a disease like piles bleeding piles etc so that is why you please take care of yourself so don't pay attention on your taste buds or your tongue please pay attention on your stomach follow the instructions of the stomach what is necessary what is what stomach needs so try to consume a satvik food easy for digestion raw vegetables fruits fruit diet salad okay apart from that a curd or a milk such such things but it should be very light and in a proper quantity because you, how much you should consume the food that is also the common question from the people so the whatever is the size or the uh, limit of your stomach only half of the stomach should be filled with the solid food after that one fourth part of the stomach should be filled with the water and one fourth part of the stomach should remain empty for the moment of that food in the stomach just like when you fill up the pot of the grinder and when you are grinding if the pot is fully loaded and if you try you start the grinder what happens immediately the cover is thrown out why because there is no space for the moment of the gases in the same way this is the churner your stomach so there it should have a proper place sufficient space for the moment of the gases so that is why one fourth part of the stomach should remain empty for the moment of the gases if you consume because when you like the food when it is very tasty that time you consume more let me eat little more and then when you feel it completely and you get the belching that time you stop okay okay now i am completely full 
but there is no place for the movement of gases and then what happens burping again and again burning sensation hiccups reflections so that is why your consumption of the food should be in limit in a proper quantity and in a proper way it should be consumed other thing how many times you should consume the food whatever is necessary for your body body will ask for you you will feel that sensation of the uh, diet that i okay i need a diet at that time whenever you will feel hungry at that time you should consume something otherwise it will create acidity so whatever the quantity if you many people ask the question that okay for the weight loss we have to reduce the quantity of quantity of the food don't reduce the quantity of the food food quantity of the food will be the same only divide that quantity in several times instead of consuming that food in only two times lunch and dinner or breakfast lunch dinner three times only instead of that divide it in five to six times little little so breakfast you divide in two or three times lunch divide it in two separate times so consume it slot by slot and little not too much food at a time then it will not create pressure on your stomach it will not create pressure on your pancreas liver your bile duct they will be working very easily and then you won't have any problem of acidity or belching or indigestion your digestive system will work properly your food consumed food will not convert in fats okay so that is why the diet should be in a proper way you should have a proper habits of a diet so don't follow your tongue follow the stomach okay all the best thank you namaste